Hey guys, so I actually have been able to at least buy one more for the time being because I was just playing around on eBay, found her for a very good deal, which I would never find again because considering she's now worth $60 and I only paid $30, that's something I could not pass up. So this is going to be a Raven Queen getting Ferris doll review. This is her in box. The box is um, actually pretty gross. Like on the outside, it's pretty dirty, but I'm not worried about that because, as you all know, I only care about the actual doll herself. I don't keep them in box unless it's a San Diego Comic Con. So we're going to open her up. And then. This is what she officially looks like. And then we can also get out the doll stand because she's old enough to have come with her own doll stand. I'm super excited for this doll because she officially now completes the Getting Fairest line of my collection, which I did not have before. So now I officially have all the Getting Fairest dolls, which is pretty exciting for me because that's about six dolls left that I have to get, but three of them come in one pack. It's the Tricastle three pack. So I count that as I only have four packages left to get for the dolls. And if we get everything ready here. So I'm going to first show you what this came with and as the off to the side accessories. So this is the stand and then she also came with a little collar it will go around her neck and as you can see um, it's a little clip so it clips on same as this one but this one I believe goes this way around her neck and then we have her little mirror yeah we need that light so, then here, we have the doll stand, which I'm getting open right now, if I can get it open. There we go. is what we have here and it comes with a brush as well but I don't I only keep one color of each brush so I'm probably gonna throw this one quite away because I've already got a silver brush and now we can get to reviewing the doll put all that aside and here she is. So she comes with these cute little black shoes, slippers that have little spikes on them. And then she comes with a cute little nightgown type of dress. And it looks like the robe is not attached. So this robe right here is separate from the actual dress that has some little skirts that go out I guess and then she has some lace around the cuffs and her hair is pretty simple pretty long as well which I like I like having the long hair and it's red, uh, purple and black I was about to say red and black but no um, this is her face as you can see 
And then she also comes with her little headphones to listen to music, which comes down here into a little music player. And that is the Raven Queen Getting Ferris doll review. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you guys in my next video whenever that is. Bye!